Did they die? He did. Was it their first overdose? It was his first, yeah. Who were they to you? He was my cousin. How did you find out? Um, I was away at college and my family called me and told me. How has it shaped or affected how you view opioids and addiction? So he was the first person that I ever knew that did drugs and actually overdosed and died. So it was my first kind of exposure to drugs. Um, and he was kind of the force that got me into working in the addiction field. Um, and ever since I've had a passion for educating people on the dangers of mixing drugs because he actually died of mixing too many depressants. So um, now when I work with clients, I, I really like to tell them a lot about mixing like benzos and heroin and how you can die from it accidentally because he accidentally died. So. Do you still love them? Of course. Do you have any words for them? Uh, just that I love him and I know that he's looking down on all of us. Who were they to you? One of my best friends. My uncle. They were one of my best friends. I do multiple services and I teach and she took classes with me and um, she was somebody that even volunteered with us at the agency for a long time. And, uh, a friend, a confidant, an artist I work with. My cousin. She was a friend, a uh, partner of seven years, best friend. One of my best friends uh, lost her husband and then uh, growing up as well, I had quite a few friends who wound up ODing uh, when we were kids, specifically in high school. Uh, they were someone that I helped out for a long time in uh, social services and one that I built a strong relationship with. Someone that I met when I lived in a subway in Athens when I ran away when I was 15. Me, I'm Amy. How it shaped me, I've had made a career out of helping people with addiction. It made me think about how he must have felt like, or if he saw people walk, like walking over him and not helping him. It made me think twice about how people shame users. I'm sorry, I didn't make enough time for you. I do overdose reversal trainings and education. I said I'm with it, and I'm down to kick it. Let's forget all the dumb shit and just get lifted. I said that I'm sorry, no are you down to party? I roll us up, split us, flip the lid and get started, yeah. And you're climbing in my window. She died in a tent in Kensington. She was there for almost over two days before somebody found her. I wound up in a coma for a couple days. You said it sucks, but you five fucking bucks, man. I call a chicken nugget girl and then we're gonna fuck. I said it's nice to see us laugh and think about the past, cause spring is on its way and this last winter's kicked our ass, man. Trash can. I think about it every day. So now we're smoking in the basement. Someone His body there. didn't have the diamond, but she shot up. So said he didn't have the Narcan, but we can't trust that fuck. No, we can't trust Sometimes him. it feels like a time bomb, but a lot of times, other times, you wish that you could know what you can just give the person. For me, it's hard to know that out of all the people that I've been able to Narcan and bring back, she wasn't one of them. I wish someone had been around. How she liked to go and see the dope kid We told her no, I guess she thought we all were joking The story slips from there every time he found her in his bed But by the time the paramedics came They did all that they could, yeah So now we're hanging up your pictures Of a red black sheep And our friends are coming over Bringing enough to eat Your things fit in two big boxes We sent down to New Orleans We were reimbursed for the postage But not for future unseen 
smoking in the basement I'm trying to figure how I'm fucking supposed to make rent One percent you died if you would change all your time I spent Cause I don't wanna die and wanna change all my time was spent And do you have any words for them? I wish you were still here I wish you were still here I love you and I love your family and I'm sorry you had to suffer like that I love them and I'm you know here to continue to fight you know I've seen a lot of great success stories folks who have come uh, you know on from the other side and like there's always hope like there's n there's nobody out there who is like beyond redemption thank you yeah Ha, 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 ha.